What's up, Mitch? Welcome back to another video. So, uh, a few seasons back, we started our first Road to Glory during the World Cup mode. Well, actually, it wasn't our first one, but our first one that we actually did like a lot of episodes of. Uh, and uh, we wanted to bring it back right now in Team of the Year uh, with a fresh new Road to Glory account, free to play account. Uh, playing this game to see how high we can get free to play. Just because I love uh, these like promos, like Team of the Year for like new accounts. Uh, because there's so many rewards that you can get out of them. Uh, you know, those new exchanges we have, those kind of things. So I feel like building out a squad right now on this one is going to be super fun. So we started up a new account, uh, which means we do have to go through all of these, like, free, uh, you know, drills and stuff like this. Um, but hopefully, if you're starting up Team of the Year right now, uh, you can follow along with our journey as we go through this. Give some tips and tricks about, uh, you know, doing the best you can in FC Mobile. Build the best squad that you can. So if you want to, uh, make sure to subscribe to the channel right now. Like this video if you want to see more of the Road to Glory series. We'll start a whole new playlist for this one uh, and uh, see how far we can kind of get with our new Road to Glory account. So uh, first thing we got to do is play through some of these drills. Now I'm not going to watch you. Uh, I'm not going to watch. I'm, I'm not going to make you watch us uh, do like 30 minutes of drills and stuff like that. Uh, I don't even want to do this. <laughs> so uh, we're going to fast forward ahead. And we got a welcome pack. A gem welcome pack. This is new though. Uh, I don't remember getting this welcome pack uh, when we did this uh, in the beginning of the season. So we got an 85 overall player that we get to Join to the squad. Grealish would be good. Uh, so uh, we're going to get Grealish out of this one, uh, which I actually am very happy about because uh, I feel like getting a good solid uh, left wing card will be helpful uh, when doing this as well. So uh, we did the quest here, uh, which does get exchanges unlocked and campaign unlocked and a welcome pack. Uh, as well from this one, although I don't seem to get the welcome packs. I'm not really sure what happened there. Uh, we completed the beginner kickoff campaign. So this I feel like has definitely changed uh, since we did this uh, when we started the season ourselves. But uh, uh, once you finish all the kind of intro quests, you do end up getting this. Then we get the uh, intermediate skill games uh, that we got. Oh, you don't get the welcome pack and exchange unlocked until you finish all this, which we obviously need to get exchanges unlocked because of the fact uh, that... Um, there's that uh, silver exchange, which we really wanted to. So this gives us 200 gems from there. Uh, then we can finish that one. Uh, two skill games. What do we unlock from two skill games? 60 overall players. Okay, not great. All right, so, ooh, daily login rewards, 1,200 gems. Ooh, man, you get a, I forgot how many, uh, oh, it's frozen here. Frozen, let me do this. I forgot how many gems you get when you start the game, though. There you go. We got into it, so 1,200 gems from that one. Uh, then we can finish off this quest here. Uh, and I think it's gonna do, oh, that actually does let us finish the whole thing off. So we get our uh, player here. I don't know who's gonna come in this welcome back. Center mid, center back, okay. Uh, I mean, not terrible, we got a Menez out of that one. So 83 overall, the Menez, uh, campaign unlock, exchange unlock. I don't know if we'll have enough silver players uh, to uh, to get that done, but uh, it looks like everything's getting unlocked. And interesting, you get, uh, when you finish this, you get Vinny unlocked, you get the market unlocked. So I actually really like this because when we started, you had to play through all the things, but I kind of like that you can just go through and unlock these things uh, this way. So uh, update the lineup, uh, learn about uh, formations, play three skill games, and score three goals in any live event. So we'll update our lineup here. Uh, so again, when you're updating your lineup, you can just do auto build, uh, probably the fastest way to do it, and then just kind of play around with the players in the right positions that you want them after. Uh, but that gets us to level, wow, level seven already. Okay, so you are leveling up very quickly now with this. Uh, formations and team editing. So formations, that's not for, I don't know why that was highlighted. That's not, for, here we go. Team editing, formations. I want to go with my 433 attack, so I'm just going to go back in there. And then that's going to claim that for you. And then you go on to uh, the skill games. Uh, where we got to play skill games and matches. Obviously, we want to play in Team of the Year because that's going to be the one that we got going on now. Uh, and that's going to be kind of the one that's going to be uh, hopefully getting us the most amount of players. All right, I'm very interested how this is going to go. Dribbling with collectibles uh, is a, uh, a challenging skill game sometimes, especially because it is the one that is 60. And, oh, we got at least we got Grealish here. So Grealish is at least going to be on this one. Uh, but we're going to have to try and get all these collectibles here uh, with Grealish. But if you don't like the ones that you get, you can reset it for free three times. Uh, I mean, I think the collectibles of the ones that you would have is probably going to be uh, the easiest one to complete, as I do that and might not even complete it here. There we go, we did. Okay, luckily we did complete it. Uh, so you have to do this uh, three times and then one of the 20s. Complete some daily quests as well from this one. We did do live events. Ooh, we did the live events thing too. 
Uh, I do have to finish off this uh, this one here uh, for 20 in order to claim what we have from here. So we're going to play this one, the box wall, uh, and then we're going to go claim our, our 200. We'll start the pathway. The only thing I'm not sure of is if I should be starting the pathway of this one because I am a little bit far uh, behind from here if I should be saving my points uh, because I'm not going to be probably able to necessarily complete the full path of this one uh, if I should save it for future weeks. But I think I will just start with this one uh, and just like hope that I can kind of get some, uh, some points and stuff uh, and some of the other ways to sort of finish off that challenge. Because the one big uh, thing about this is the ultimate team of the year. You do have the ultimate team of the year uh, here where you do need to complete these, uh, these quests here. And the bottom one is to claim 30 rewards, but there's all the additional rewards that you're going to need to go through there. So I do eventually want to try and complete those, but I am a little worried because we are going to have the next weeks. And if that also allows me to complete it, it's going to be harder to get these ones. But just to give myself a chance of doing it, we are going to claim this here, and then we are going to go along uh, and just do as much as we can along the way. So it is 30 rewards, by the way. So when you're doing this, you can do some of the ones off to the side. But my suggestion with this, as you're going through and claiming it, if you just want to get the ultimate team of the year players, just pick all of the cheap ones. Some of these ones in here are going to cost you 50 points. Some are going to cost you 60 points. Uh, but you should avoid using any of the ones like the hundreds and stuff like that until you absolutely have to uh, in order to go through that. So there's a lot of ones even here, like if you do the Mascherano one at the end, uh, you got 50, 50, 50 all the way until you have the 100 at the end. So do all the 50s first. And then, I mean, Mascherano could be that additional 30th reward that you get because you don't have to claim every single reward here in order to get the 50 rewards. Uh, and you can choose whichever path you want. So kind of that's my strategy uh, that I'm sort of going with there. So we'll go back over to here. Uh, we'll claim this here for doing the uh, intermediate pack. Uh, I don't know why I didn't get three gold. Oh, probably because I have to play like a skill game in order to do that. Uh, and then we have the quest master that we have from here. Do that out of that. Okay. Uh, I'm also going to train up Grealish. Uh, we'll get him to level five uh, just so that we have a little bit of uh, a little bit of help with that one. I don't know if I have enough silver players. Uh, on the bench to do any of these exchanges yet. Uh, we'll see what happens here. Oh, we do actually. Uh, oh, 89. Oh, this is the daily one. I forgot you get the daily one. Walk out quad. Oh man, can you imagine we got a team of the year right away out of that? But uh, that is a good way to start it there. I mean, what a fitting way to get there. We got Immobile out of that first one. Uh, Kamavinga as well. So uh, that's good. Uh, but uh, we do have this. So this one, I'm not going to have enough. Uh, players from there because most of them are going to be on the team. So we have to collect some silver players. That's going to be my main goal is to get some new silver players added to the squad. But we do get this first exchange uh, one done with the standard pack out of there. Um, and so getting some more good ranking things going on. And we are going to actually, I'm just going to auto build. I'm just going to auto build on my lineup. But I want to try and make my lineup a little bit uh, kind of stronger uh, when going through this because if I'm going to try and play that challenge, <laughs> I'm going to need some good players on the team. Very interesting. We have a 75 overall squad trying to do this challenge win. I don't know if it's going to actually be possible uh, for us to uh, win this, but if we can get to the end of this one, we are going to have a, uh, a very solid uh, addition to our squad. So uh, that's going to be kind of our big one of this one. So uh, And if we get three goals in this, I think we're going to unlock the next one as well. So the first match doesn't seem so bad so far. Uh, they are a bit lower of an overall. Let's get a big shot. Oh, man, I forgot that. When they're gold players, they cannot shoot. Okay, so that was not ideal. I'm hoping to we get extra time uh, and uh, in this one. We'll find out. But, uh, I mean, we're doing pretty well so far. Kamavinga sends that up there. He's going to look for this again. He's in the box. I'm going to take a shot, though. Big shot there. Oh, man, big save. Rebound. Ah, corner. Okay, here we go. Yes, okay. Uh, so, at least it's not, it's not a challenging first match. I am thinking that the last match is going to be very hard for us. Uh, but the first match is kind of a little bit of a uh, one that, I mean, we're beating it with the 75 overall squad that we've had for 20 minutes into this game. So, I mean, the biggest thing, and this is a tip, if you're starting out in this game and you want a tip for playing against the AI, don't use the sprint speed button. The AI is less likely to attack you if you just kind of uh, move the ball around. So the less you use that, the better it's going to kind of uh, be. As you see, they don't really kind of go after us until I start using the sprint button. Once I start using the sprint button, they're going to kind of run at you a little bit more. So if you have space, it's good to do that. Uh, lots of back and forth movements, uh, really helpful with that as well, especially if you're trying to waste time there at the end uh, so that they won't get the, uh, the ball back. I mean, it's that last one that we really need. And that's why I feel like that last one is probably going to be beyond our uh, our capabilities of playing. I mean, we'll find out. I haven't played the weekend tournament on any of my accounts yet, so I'm not sure how difficult it's going to be. But a 90 overall in the second. Oh, man. A 90 overall, two goals down. 
This, uh, this is already looking like it could be a challenge here. So again, lay off that sprint speed button if you're trying to get goals with this one. Uh, that's going to be the biggest help there. As we try to go through, unless you get into the box, then you're going to want to try and get the uh, sprint to try and get some space as we look for that one. I definitely think it's doable here. We've had a lot of close opportunities. Uh, crossbar on one of them, uh, just getting stopped at the end on the other. Uh, get that. No free kick, thank you. Okay, Grealish. Big shot! Big save. Alright, off the post and in Grealish. 70 minutes into this, I mean, it's uh, it's still a lot to do. If we do not have the, uh, the extra time, we are going to be in a lot of trouble here. But we did get one back. Uh, we still need to get another one, and I mean, there's still a fair amount of time, uh, and that is the one good thing about this, is uh, 20 minutes does give you a decent amount of time. I mean, I think if you had any squad higher than this, it should be, uh, it should be alright uh, going through and playing this weekend mode. Although, if they get a cross in here, that's not good. Ake, yes, takes it away. Okay, bring it back. Let's see what we got here. Here we go. Oh, you know what I should do? I should claim my, I'm going to claim my icon, and that's going to help me out before I do the next one. Gets it into the box. Nice little turn. Nice. Oh my goodness. Crossbar again. Great. Let's get there. Come on. Penalty shot. And then as walks in, we get the second. I mean, that is, you got to get in close. Uh, when you have low shooting players, you got to get in close on that. Uh, so, uh, I mean, I'm going to hopefully try and get one more before uh, the 90 minutes is up here as we go with this one. All right, let's see it. Big shot goal. And after you get up, all you got to do is just get the ball back and then just like pass it around your defense for the last 15 minutes if you want to be safe with the victory there. I mean, you could try and get a second goal uh, to make it a little bit uh, cleaner of a victory, but I think we might even get to, uh, oh, I'm going to say kickoff in the second half. All right, so we come out with a victory in that one. That one was a little bit scarier. Uh, so we're going to add the icon to the squad, pick our icon. Uh, I mean, we do get an 85 to a 92 from there. Uh, we did complete a few more tasks. Oh, that's also very good, too, because we're going to get Vinny uh, added to the squad here. So that's going to actually be very helpful uh, to our squad as well. So uh, that is going to be a big part there uh, to get him added. Interesting, too, I think he might actually be optional. So I could technically sell him and try and pick up some other players from there. Uh, but that's going to be a big addition. I don't know if I... I might actually put him as my uh, as my right wing though. Actually, I think I'm gonna put him as my as my left wing. I'll put Grealish as my right wing. The other thing I'm gonna do, and I don't know that you should really do this, but I mean, do that cards are not super hard to obtain. But I'm gonna make them a little bit higher just so I can really uh, have them help me out for this uh, for this last match here. So we're gonna give him uh, some dexterity so he gets a little bit extra pace. Uh, and then I'm gonna train him up as much as I can train him up. Uh, I only want to use the bronze cards for training right now, uh, just because I don't want to. Um, I want to keep my silvers for the exchanges. Okay, here we go. Icon Evolutions. Uh, ooh, Revaldo. Okay, so this is the problem. We got Revaldo in there. Cannavaro is probably going to be the best long-term choice. Uh, but for me right now in this, I almost feel like Lampard, Revaldo uh, are going to be better for me. Uh, just because of the fact that they're going to be stronger to help me, uh, you know, play through the game and stuff like that. So I, I am interested. I, I also, I just honestly... The, probably the least likely one I am to pick on my regular account would be Lampard, but I'm kind of tempted uh, to pick him up on this one just so that uh, I have uh, that card uh, to start off with, right? So that, that way I have like a good center mid card that I can use, but then Rivaldo also going to be very strong there. Uh, so, But now I have Vinny as the left wing, so that's why I'm like, kind of against Vinny, but I don't know. Maybe Cannavaro is good because then I do have a, a strong defensive card uh, in the game. So I think I actually will go with Cannavaro in this one. Uh, although I do need to get some wins apparently to even uh, get I didn't realize I needed to get wins just to get to uh, get him to start with how many did I need to get him? Oh, so I have to still win five games before I even get his base one So that was not as I thought I was gonna get him right away. So not as helpful as I thought Big save Vinny! Yes, rebound! I love that. Okay, my star player is one of my silvers though So I like that look at that big shot and right where he needs to be puts in the rebound uh, and uh, now with 31 minutes into this, we need two goals uh, to make this happen. And uh, my team feels like they're really, uh, they're really uh, inspired from this. I feel like we got some good feeling of pace here. We just got to make sure we don't give up a goal here, especially because you know that they love the crosses. You know that they love the crosses, and we uh, block it out there. 36 minutes into this one. Oh, send him, send him, send him. Ah, shoot, that was... Through balls, never a good idea unless you have a lot of pace in this one. So and I feel like there's no point in sending through balls unless you actually have a bunch of pace. And look what happens when we did it. We got confident, we sent a through ball, and they put a goal back. 
Oh, this is not going to be good. We have the run, but you know that they're going to call it as soon as we get in the box. They don't, and Krillich puts it in. Thank you, SC Mobile. I know you love to call halftime at the worst possible times, and that time, they didn't. And I, and I got to be really appreciative of that, because lots of times, that's when half would get called. As soon as the shot comes off his foot. And there's the first beautiful back and forth play. Puts it in, and uh, we are uh, in need of one more goal. The box, let's see it. Dyer! Woohoo! Eric Dyer with a uh, clutch header off the corner. And uh, we're going into defensive mode. We need to win this ball back, and then I am just going to uh, keep possession of this ball because I am not going to want to risk. Uh, having to get another goal here. I mean, the goals have actually come fairly easily, I feel like. This was, honestly, I feel like it was easier to score in this match than it was in the last match. Uh, so uh, we're going to just play around with this. We've got 40 minutes to do this. I'm not going to make you watch us do this. We'll get to the end. All right, there it is. Final score. Time to claim our reward. I mean, good start. Day one. Uh, and we're going to get ourselves an 88, I feel like, plus player here. So hopefully a team of the year on day one. No team of the year. Uh, so uh, that part is unfortunate. Uh, and uh, the fact that we're not even really getting a super high overall uh, card is a bit unfortunate. Although we did get a couple good players. Uh, Ramos is going to also be helpful for us on defense as well. So uh, I would have hoped for some better rewards out of that one. But at least we do have uh, a few things that we can do to uh, build our squad up a little bit here. Uh, so again, looking at this one, uh, we're going to move players around. Okay, so I think, I think we're going to have enough actually right now uh, to do this once. We do have enough to do one of these exchanges so hopefully it will get us something big it does do exchange tutorials let's go walk out we do get a walk out icon let's go oh my goodness that is a very good way to start that probably is base overall yeah it's base overall but i mean uh the fact that we uh clutched out an icon in the first time there uh not disappointed by that at all and then we do get the uh this uh gems that we get from there so the 50 gems from there uh, and then a 70 79 overall player. Ooh, we got 10. Nice. We can do it again. Yeah, I like that with the exchange. So uh, uh, complete the player exchange 85 to 97. Ooh, I wonder if I can do that 85 to 97 exchange. I should look at trying to do these tutorials. Okay, but we do have the ability to do this exchange one more time. Come on, walk out. Walk out. No, walk out this time. But we do get a uh, goalkeeper. I don't know if it's going to be a higher goalkeeper. Uh, and then we do not have enough to do this. I mean, let's see what's in the market. Silvers are probably too expensive, though. Okay, I know I shouldn't do this, but I'm going to do the standard pack twice. I should probably be saving up for this, but I just want to add as many players as I can to our squad right now. Uh, get a couple uh, extra players from that one. So we'll be able to do this a couple times. Uh, just get a few. Ooh, not bad, though. Uh, I mean, for uh, for what we have in this account, decent uh, out of that one. And then we're going to be able to do the action pack thing from here. Uh, claim some extra daily rewards from there. Then we got to do the division rivals, uh, those things as well. The one thing I like about this, too, like once you get these ones done, uh, you're going to get an ultra pack for finishing this. So, ooh, I get a standard pack if I perform training five times. Let's do that again. I think it probably means I have to do it separately five times. So I'm going to do it. Yeah, it did. So you have to do it separately five times. So just train once at a time and then you'll get that. And then another standard pack. Walk out. Let's go. Yo, watch it be messy. Uh, go, yo, Martinez. Evie Martinez. Uh, not bad. I mean, we don't need another goalkeeper, but I don't mind that. Okay, so I'm going to sell some of these players. I mean... Uh, I don't know that you want to be selling these players right now, but uh, I just want some coins with this one. And then I'm going to try and uh, get the uh, as many silvers as I can to trade back into it. All right, so we sold our players. Did enough to get this exchange at least a couple more times. I think two times probably only is what we can do. But hopefully we'll get a walkout out of this. No walkout. 86. Yo, that's not bad. Uh, we got two, well, Arsenal, former Arsenal player, uh, out of this one with Rosicky and uh, Zinchenko uh, in this. So uh, don't mind that. And we do get one more of these ones. We'll hope for a walkout out of this. It's a walkout team of the year. No, but Icon. Hey, striker there. Yeah, Hernandez. Uh, so pretty decent uh, out of there. 87 only as base overall, uh, but still pretty good there uh, with that Hernandez card. So uh, I don't know if we have enough to do one more. Do we have enough to do one more? No. All right, so we got a few more players in this one. We'll see what we get. No walkout. Uh, 83. I mean, if they sell, you can pretty much uh, put back in. Uh, you need, I know, you basically need like almost 
what, like a million coins or whatever to do one of them if you want to get it quickly, 900,000 coins. Uh, you can probably get them for a lot cheaper if you spend a lot of time doing it, but uh, that's kind of uh, what we're looking at for each one. So we're not really making back on these ones, but there is always that chance, right? I forgot, you also have this exchange. So you can also do this exchange twice a day. And that's going to give you 10 silvers from that. Here we go. Ah, no walkout. Only 400,000 uh, total out of that. All right, but I mean, here we go. We'll, we'll take a look at the squad. I mean, we do have obviously some out of position players. Uh, quite a few out of position players in this one right now. Uh, but I mean, 84 overall, 50 million coin squad. Uh, after playing for, what do we have? 53 minutes, including the tutorial. Uh, so good start to this. I think as we continue in team of the year, we're gonna continue to build this up a little bit more, but I'm excited to keep going on this journey. Uh, thank you for checking this out. Thank you for stopping by. Pleasure's always, Godspeed.